song too. Do you know your music? So tell them what we got. We have a Beatles album called Yellow Submarine, but I don't actually know if this is the soundtrack. No, this or is not the soundtrack. This is not the soundtrack. Okay, so did this come out before or after the movie came out? After, because it came out in 1969. The movie came out in 68. Okay, no, they can't see you because you got it. So movie came out in 68, album came out in 69. Did the soundtrack come out in 68 with the movie? No, that came out in 1999. It did? Yeah, the soundtrack did. Oh, okay. And this is the back with the yellow submarine. And it's on Apple because it's from 1969. It was their first album that year, so it was the album that came out after the White Album. Okay, Let's so get does this have just the song? This has songs. Side one is the is Beatles, and side two is the orchestra. Oh, okay. George Martin Orchestra. Ready? Yeah. We got Yellow Submarine, which was originally on Revolver. Okay, yep. Yeah. Pretty, pretty popular one. Yeah, that's the name of the album. I think I'm, I think I read that the only reason they made Yellow Submarine was to sell a bunch of Beatles stuff. It worked. I know, it does. There's everything Beatles is Yellow Submarine now. Only a Northern Song. Which it's about the, um, I think they're like publishing company, Northern Songs. Yeah. And um, George didn't want to write a song for the movie, but he had to, so he wrote only a Northern song. Interesting. So this was in the movie? Uh huh. Okay. All Together Now. Yeah, that's a good one. I feel like it doesn't get enough play. Yeah. It's a good one. I really like it. This is my favorite Beatles song ever, and we've had it on the show a few times. Yeah. So we got Yellow. I mean, and is this the Beatles. only album it was ever on? Yeah, besides other like Yellow Submarine albums, but it was also on the Beatles Rock and Roll Music album from the 70s. Oh, okay. Volume two. Yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. So yeah. This was one of the longest Beatles song. It's all too much. I really like this guitar part. And nobody really knows who plays guitar on it, but it's probably Paul. Because George played organ on this one. And probably, I don't know, but probably not John. This is one of the longest ones? Yeah, it's six minutes and 25 seconds. Okay, I mean, I can think of a couple longer ones. But... Like Revolution 9 or Hey Jude. Right. Those are the only two that are longer? Mm, no. Uh, what else is longer? I want you, she's so heavy. That's the only other one. Okay. We got All You Need Is Love from Magical Mystery Tour. Yeah. But, okay. So some just... of these songs were on other albums and some weren't. Yeah, they should have just made side one the entire, um, actually just, um, song, new songs. But kept Yellow Submarine and then. Oh, okay. Yeah. And got rid of All You Need Is Love. But it's still a good song because it's also cool it's on two albums like Yellow Submarine. So is this the same version that's on? Yeah. Okay. I'm just thinking about this right now. It's really weird. This is on two albums. We got Pepperland. Now we're on the George Martin stuff. This is one is from the beginning of the movie. Okay. You know? I mean, I've heard this song before, but I wouldn't have been able to say where in the movie it was. It says some sitar in it. Oh. Don't remember what part this is from. You don't? No. I'm surprised. This is easy, what the name is. It's from the Sea of Holes. Mm. So there's lots of seas in this movie. Mm -hmm. So the next one is... Okay, we've got Sea of Time, Sea of Holes, and now we're going to play Sea of Monsters. Mm. This is from when you meet the Blue Meanies. Ooh. I'm looking at the cover. Oh yeah, there is a Blue Meanie. 
I'm like, but there's one, two, three blue meanies. One right here, and two right here. March of the meanies. Mm -hmm. No, this is the one that you, when you meet the meanies. Must be another one. Pe Pepperland Waste. So, laid waste, so. So they're destroying Pepperland at this point? No, they've already destroyed it. Oh, okay. But this is when they enter Pepperland. Yellow Submarine and Pepperland. These are the first time we've ever done this. And um, I was thinking, should we just do side one or should we do all of this stuff? Well, this is kind of hard to explain, but I'm sad that they had to have this orchestra stuff when they could have just added. You don't like this stuff? No, I don't like it. It's just, would have been cooler if they had like um more, this was a full album. So if you see at the beginning, it's basically yellow submarine, but mm -hmm. I heard that. orchestra playing. So let's hear it again. It's kind of like sing along junk from McCartney. Yeah, but that's true. There you have it. So cool album, uh -huh. uh, classic cover artwork mm -hmm. and everything. Um, Mm -hmm. And so, why do you think they came out with the one in 1999? Don't know. Oh, okay. Alright. It's, wait. 20th anniversary. Oh. Or was it 30th? 30th. Anniversary? Yeah, 30th. 30th anniversary. Yeah. Maybe that's why. Okay. So. What else you got on Yellow Submarine? Yellow Submarine. Okay. You got this yellow submarine, and I've seen some pictures of like from like a yellow submarine single from like 66, and it's not at all like this. Oh, really? I guess I'll, for like a 45 color. This is oh, because no. that didn't didn't exist until the movie came yeah. out. Yeah. Mm. Bye.